Good evening and welcome back to Factory Town where it's time we paved some stone or got stoned or became stoned or just stone. Let's do with stone. We want to get stone over to here, we also want to get stone over to here and we want to get stone to stone brick as well which I kind of want to do in the mining area because stone can be added to the mining area here we have stone in the list here so let's do that so let's uh, bring over the stone uh, let's do two here because we kind of want to do two i'm gonna throw 10 workers in here uh, how are we doing for workers uh we're good we're good for workers yeah we're good okay uh, so let's run one out like this and uh i don't know where to don't know where to. Let's run another one out like this. Oop, okay. Uh, and what we'll do is we want to have... Um, well, the, the stone's going to be here. And the idea is that we're going to have stone, uh, which is going to go uh, to the town centre just to store stone for us. And also we're going to have stone... Uh, well, that's not stone because that's just for... Uh, which is going to go to the stone mason, which is going to make stone brick in order to do the things we want to do so and the stone brick is going to come back out and be sold here but we're going to also have so we're going to have like two so this is iron this is iron this is stone this is stone one will be stone just going to the base and one will be stone for stone brick maybe both and then we're going to have another set of stone here one will be stone going to uh stone brick and another one will be just stone being sold maybe i don't know how much stone brick we actually need uh so i don't really know if i want to build a giant connection what we're done here i've got forestry and i've got that um, i guess we do i guess we do want to do that let's just let's just do that and be done with it uh let's copy all of this uh, we can't afford it because we need stone so we can't do that okay so let's uh let's connect one of you up to this guy and get some things working uh i think i'm going to temporarily just literally move this over to here for the moment um and we'll just connect up the outside one to i want to say the town center go to the town center and we'll go that way as well to the stonemason but I want to prioritize the stonemason first. So we'll put in a pusher there. That prioritize the stonemason. And then from the stonemason, we want to come out and go to the town center as well. So uh let's do that. This is this is definitely a temporary build here. Just to, there you go. Right, okay. Bum, bum, bum. And then this is going to have a uh, stone brick um, in it. I don't believe we need stone. We need stone to build things like ourselves, but I don't think we need stone brick in any recipes. Whereas uh, I don't the workshop, um, if we go to recipes here and come down, uh, wooden rails we're never going to make, so that's fine. Uh, do we need any stone brick? Not in there, we don't. Okay, what about a uh, machine job? Which we couldn't do a machine job, could we? <laughs> no, we couldn't do a machine job. Can we need a stone brick? Aha, so, okay. So, right, so you're going to go in there, so that's fine. So, put up there, and then you're getting stone put in you. And stone brick is coming as well, which is awesome. Okay, and what I can do as well is if I do um, that and that that will allow us to prioritize mining on there which means you will then be getting a 10 percent bonus 20 percent bonus to get extra stone brick which is nice we get free stone brick which is always nice um yeah i don't think it's uh um we've only got uh workshops and food mills dotted around we haven't got anything uh no i've got any machine shops yet hmm Okay, okay, well we should get some stone brick coming in. Awesome, let's build a machine shop. Once we get 40. There you go. Oh, and this is only just a, a test to find out what we need. So you 
want stone for rails. But no stone brick. Okay, so stone brick isn't actually needed on the system. Stone is. I think there's only like one recipe that needs stone brick. Um, we could do stone for rails. Do I really want to put stone on the main thing? I don't. I don't really. I really don't think I do. I said because this. There's one recipe which is which is the wooden. So if we wanted to make the rails like the long way, which is uh, wooden rail, then to iron rail, we still need the stone anyway. So, uh, but we don't need the rails because we've got them coming in from the trader here, which I would like to replace at some point to be honest with you. But also, once we build the outside rail, we don't need rails. So that's uh, I might just leave that there or move it somewhere else and. Yeah. Well, maybe we move it to the farming area so we can get more stuff going on with that. Well, let's leave this going like this for the moment. This this will be fun. This will back up eventually. Um, it'll fill up to uh, what are we at? Three, five thousand. We're at five thousand. So it'll fill up to five thousand stone and five thousand brick eventually. It's not going very quickly though. Um, I would very much like to have more going on here so I want to do the same we've done here I just don't want to have the packager do the thing you've got a packager here so you're packaging the planks so we can send the planks out as well uh, where would the planks be pick up from here uh, or here I'm not sure I'm not sure on this one uh, we need planks as well I'm sure that's that as well we're going to need planks we need planks at the moment to do what we want to do at the moment here but that's fine um so you are drop off so so, so pick up to this side so where that chasing is so the planks want to come down here and be picked up there so that needs a train as well okay okay right so we do want to have this sort of system set up here for making yeah making stone brick uh you, I think, produce enough to fill up here. Okay. Okay, so let's... Um... Let's grab this again. Now we can build it again. Let's come down here. Uh, let's put it in... Uh... Yeah, that'll work. Put it in there. Try to think where it's going to get the um, the stone, the the um, stone, the uh, yeah, the stone from. So the stones are in mine there. So where should we put it in like that way? Yeah, let's do that. Put on like that. Okay. We will get rid of the packager. Packages. Uh, we're not going to put stone on the main system. We don't need it. So. We can't do that. Um, let's filter you to be... Stone. Uh, oh. And stone brick. Not that we ever need this much stored, to be honest with you, but it's fine. What did I do here? Did we do... Uh, yeah, that's the same. Okay. Um, right, stone and brick. So stone will be mined here, uh, and it will come out, and it will go split to there and to here. Get rid of those. We don't need those inputs there. Um, get rid of those for the minute, because you probably want to be up by one. So get rid of those, 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 those. Right, okay. Let's, um... Oh, dear. Wrong bad. Wrong bad. Uh, let's turn off this for a moment. We want to put in four of these guys. So I'm going to put them in facing towards the station. You 
only got one um, it's a peculiar recipe which is going to be stone brick we're not doing polished stone oh we do want polished stone as well um so we might have to build another one of these to get polished stone later that's 10 stone but that's okay we can we can do that later so we're gonna have stone here which is going to come out it's going to split between this to make these and then come back to the base and then we might have more stone like here because this is only temporary just to because there was fire stone under the ground um and we'll put stone here as well um and that stone can come down and actually that stone can pretty go directly to um polished stone because polished stone requires a lot of stone so yeah okay so we delete that one let's get rid of these get rid of this as well so this will come in from that side but for now it's going to come in from this side uh because we can as we can um also want a lot of stone inside how are we doing for that 805 stone uh i think we're okay for stone no probably gonna need more if we're building stuff yeah so i do want to have one of these go out to bit of that come in uh, there instead please then go down um you will come along uh, right now ah, this is what i want to change this is what i want to change so um we are going to have uh an up there um, i feel like this will have more inputs from this one instead it might might input this first and then and then from there it will input it will go out so I'm not i'm not sure the final layout of this at the moment i just i just i just kind of feel like i want to get it working so uh, let's do that and then do that and then on top of that i'm going to put in the pillars uh, we'll go all the way for the minute uh, yeah we'll go all the way for a minute don't need to but yeah okay then these will come in like that These are going to grab stone. These are going to grab stone brick. Then this is going to also grab stone brick. <laughs> and this is going to run out because these are all going to start doing their thing all four of them and one one line is not going to be enough to do that um also you are not doing well for two lines of stone but it's it's okay it's okay it's a thing it's working it's doing its thing um kind of there's no way you can prioritize outputs so i can't prioritize this output um over one of the other ones um there's just there's just no way to do it um yeah you can't prioritize which one does which uh we could add yellow coin boosters to make this go faster um yeah steam doesn't do anything the only thing you can do is add a yellow coin boosters to make it mine faster if you wanted to but but um, it, it's all right. It's all right as a temporary setup. It's fine. It's fine. Now these are going to start running out of stone, which will slow the whole process down, but that's okay. Then you're going to get stone as well. And remember, this is going to take ages to fill up because it has to back up to 5,000. So, got a while. We got a while. We don't need stone brick on the main bus, so I don't need this one here. So let's not do that. Don't, don't worry about that. Um... Yeah, we might need stone brick on the bus. We'll figure that out should should we require it. What I need is I need stone brick so I can actually build the things I want to build. That's the problem. That's the biggest problem here. So, um, right. Um, what we do need to do is this here because this is one that I've missed completely. So let's... Um, uh, let's... Uh, where am I? Here, okay. Um...
want to grab this is a pickup so grab a pickup from here uh, in fact i don't know what we can move this one because we're not using this one and it wants to go here uh but needs to go over a couple because i can't i can't ever tell the time so it's it's just twice isn't it so well, there we go. One, two, three, one, two, three, two, three, one, two, three. Like that. Is that right? Yes, that's right. Okay. And then you will come out down and into this guy. So this guy is going to be for wooden planks. You are going to come out of there. And you're going to come down the very first run. No, you're not. You're going to come down the second run and do that. Okay. Because I don't know what else is going to be in here. I don't think anything. Well, there's going to be apples and other bits of pieces and stuff going on in here. So, yeah. I don't think any recipes need logs. Uh, let's see here. So, what do we got here? We've got wooden conveyor belt, not fussed about wooden conveyor belt. We don't need that. And we do need wooden wheels. Um, hadn't planned on that, and they do require. No, they come from planks, so that's okay. So that's, that's some planks here. So the only thing that requires uh, logs or just wood, I should say, is wooden conveyor belt. We're not going to make that. We're going to skip that and go straight to a cloth conveyor belt. But we won't use the wood one. We'll use the standard one, which is this one here, uh, and that comes from planks. So we're good for that. So we've got planks coming in. Awesome. Okay. Cool. Plank, plank, plank. Nice. Right. So, um, what town is this? This is town at number. Two. We do not have a track for town number two. Let's fix that. And I have a track on this side for town number two. Do 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 do. Bloop. And what I can do is I can come from here and I can do this to there because for some reason you can overlap the track when you're building it but you can't overlap the track when you're copying it which is weird i must admit very strange but meh. okay so there's number two right so number two uh don't doesn't require any drop-offs that i know of as well like the forestry doesn't need any drop-offs whatsoever um there's nothing you can make Yeah, you don't need any drop-offs whatsoever. So we might even do uh, wooden, uh, wooden. Do we need wooden pipes? I don't think we need wood pipes. What are wooden pipes used for? <laughs> fluid pipe layers. Are there fluid pipes? Yeah, we can make fluid pipes here as well. They'll just be stashed in the base. So again, we might do a set of trees, put them, and have them for going to the base, and that'll be fine. So, yeah, yeah. Okay, so you're emptying. It's very interesting that you're. Oh, it's because you're packaging uh, three at a time oh I keep pushing F I keep pushing F for more data I need to unbind that um this will be fine this will be fine okay so you are number two so that is your return so two so this is the clockwise one so that's going this way down and we go this way and down like this but um okay then we're gonna go dum and dum, and this is going to be uh two pick dash up copy. I don't remember if I changed the other ones as well that I was gonna do, but yeah, it's fine. Um, and then this is going to be um the return. So we're just gonna do whatever is needed for that thing here. So right now, uh the only one that's needed is town number five. So uh uh, one two three four five no i'm not going that way we're going this way um, nope that's wrong we've gone one too far that way and then that one will be there so this is town number five right but um yep five drop off but um there we go okay so we're gonna need to do the rail for five as well Let's do the rail for five. 
that is five. Bump five. One, two, three, four, five. I did do five. So well, I think I got up to five then run out of uh, rail. So, um, yeah, because uh, although we have a lot of rail being made, um, and you see the number going up ridiculously fast because of how I've got the, I've got like nine inputs going on here. We've got a lot of rail in, in like buffer by now. So we've got a uh, sort of practically two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, uh, 1,600, 3,600, uh, sorry, uh, 3,200, um, 4,800, 4,800 plus, uh, I think, so we've got 5,800 rail in, like, back up, this, this fills up to 5,800 rail in total, we can only really spend 1,000 rail, and then we've got to wait for it to fill up again, uh, which is why I've spent up here, so, um, also, um, I think we're pretty good, although it does take one of, one of these lines all the way around is about 500 rail, so two of them comes to about a thousand. I've done some of it here, um, and then I decided against doing any more because uh, I was then getting confused with things. But then we came up with a much better plan for doing these here, like this. This rail stops here because coal comes here and goes back again. It's going to have to go that way at some point. Um, just haven't got around to it. So, but that's okay. That's okay. So we're going to push this one here, and this is going to be five. Um, drop off. Is that right? And five sale. I was thinking about this as well. I was thinking about this as well. Um, so I'm, I'm double label. La 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 yeah, I haven't labeled double label stuff here. So we've got one pickup, two pickup, three pickup, four. So I've double labeled everything. I'm kind of thinking I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that because even though we've done it here, one, two pickup, two sale, two pickup, sale, it, it's kind of pointless because it's redundant pushing it along like that. Um, uh, although, um, oh, I haven't done the rest of it here. Ah, I think, ah, what I was going to do was I, I was going to do it here and then just copy and paste these guys. But then I was thinking, why do I just not do that? Um, why do I not have, uh, just these center ones. So I want to have the town number pickup or drop off whatever this is here so so we'll do that because of the filtering we've got there um, but i was thinking why do i not just literally have um like just just, just go back to the name and it's just one and have the trains labeled as one and then on a separate one e and it would have have like um one so the, the first number is the train that is owned by the town is owned by so it's owned by one and then it has a second tag which would be the pickup and then a third tag which would be sale or drop off and then i just have this as uh one so this would be one and one this would be two and two three and three so forth, so forth. um and then this will be labeled as four comma drop off but I'm not sure if that worked because then they'd just be tagged as drop off and they could hit a drop off and come down here. So no, maybe it is better to do it this way and have have to double tag things, which is kind of annoying. But um I can't I can't I can't label the train with one drop off and have it as a sale tag to it because it will come to here. Uh, and these are one pickup, for instance, and then it will it will come there. So um well, this is one sale, so it'd be a one drop off, but it would it would come to here. There you go, humble one drop off. I'm coming down here. Um, but it should be a one drop off and a sale. I need like I need to have both tags on it, which is kind of awkward to do, but I'm trying to think of a, of a cleaner way to do it rather than having to type out like is it a sale train? Is it a this train? Is that it, it should have like a a tag for the place it is, a tag for something else, so on and so forth. So um, I also thought about doing it with trains, uh, the item filters, because you can filter the uh, carriages. So I could filter the carriages on this to be mana brick. So it still follows the mana brick one here. But then I could filter like the train itself with a custom filter. 
um, so we can make our own filters it's possible to make our own filters and we can make a one filter or a two filter for instance and then the train will come down here and go well hey I'm one so I go this way because I'm that filter I know I'm this this tag um, this here this filter and then we can just tag the uh, signals inside it as you know what pickup it is and if it's a sale or not but then again we end up back in the situation I think before uh, I'm, I, I thought about this and now I'm actually saying it out loud it's a dumb idea I should really just continue with where we have here um, and actually do things so I haven't done all the stuff here for like the pickups and sales and stuff so um, so this is going to be a five drop off um, and this should technically be a five sale as well but that, that's that's what I mean so all of them are redundant because we're doing five pickup and so this is one pickup and a one sale so that's why I should combine it into a single tag and then here I have this as a sale uh, tag so the set so any sale trains come down here to sell things and then this is a pickup tag and then the the trains go up here as a pickup so this is a pickup tag um, or drop-off tag we should work because if you're on this is coming down here isn't it so five should both be disabled uh because you'll never you're never going to go to five but um yeah they should both be disabled so if you end up on is there one that none of these point to each other so none so the, the redundancy of this coming along and coming down uh has been fixed with this style of system so this this arrow wherever it is will never point directly to another one of these um so this could literally just be tagged as two and the train is either a drop off or a sale so it'll be it'll have the, the first tag on a train will be who was owned by so two for instance um and then these are just labeled pickup and these are labeled sale and the train has either a pickup or a sale they don't have like a one sale or a two sale they just have the word sale on them so if you're on track one and you're a sale train you must be going to one of these tags you obviously will have to have the same item filters as well that's where it comes into it so it must have both this and that but if you're a sale train you'll come down here and then when you come back you'll be a four train which is what this is and i haven't filtered this properly but this has been working because it's the only place for it to go so i think that's going to be the better way of doing it have it all as one two three four which i think is see, this is a one pickup two pickup so this should just be one two three four through here i think that's going to be the better way to do it so what i mean by how things evolve over time um so if we just change this to be a pickup so we change the rail signal to be a pickup okay then if a train comes through here and has the pickup tag it will come down here because i'm on rail two and i'm trying to pick something up Boom. so i'll come down here and pick something up but on there you go i'm a pickup train i'm owned by by a um town two no right okay i'll tell you what i see what i'm losing my train of thought again and um and and i'm looking at the clock and realizing the time thing so i'm gonna muck about with the train signals off camera and see whether i can actually i'm, I'm happy with the train signals as they are um I'm, i want to be lazy and i just don't want to have to type so much out basically that, that's the idea of it i just i don't want to have to type five drop off i want to just type five and this goes down the five track um a two train will never end up on a two track so this will be fine so it'd be a five so it would just be a five so it'd be train five so we tag it with two so it's a two train five, um thank you very much for watching everybody i hope you have enjoyed this one so indecisive with this so indecisive but i hope to see you again in the next one and until then as always have fun